Grad, Angola. These days, the world, our beautiful world is crying. We find ourselves at a critical time where many people are facing unimaginable struggles that weigh heavily on our hearts. The spread of the war in some parts of the world and the accelerated climatic changes. These realities have brought immense pain, loss and difficulties and increasing poverty and hunger in the world. On this stage, we have the opportunity to share with you and by our influence to create awareness about the suffering faced by these people that live in war-torn regimes and the deterioration of environment. Please, let's stop the war and violence and let's create and promote a golden rule to respect, love, and honor each other and give the other generations a better future. The best world is in front of us. Please, let's join hands and forge peace together. Thank you. Come on. Miss Grand Colombia. I have lived wars both in my country and in my own life. I have felt the pain of loss and death in my own flesh. I feel your pain, Israel and Palestine. An ongoing war for many years that discriminates none, all victims just humans. It feels almost impossible to implore just a few to stop the war, to stop taking lives of innocent people. In my country, it seems like the damage cannot be completely repaired, and I see this in societies. But there is hope. There are nations that have achieved peaceful agreements, and I think all of us together can unite in the same purpose. We cannot change the past, but we can start working together now, rebuilding ourselves with love. Love is what has raised nations after wars. Today, I want to ask you, we demand peace, but what are you doing for peace in the world? Thank you. Miss Grand Dominican Republic. As a beauty queen, I passionately advocate for harmony and peace. Let's work on a better future, not only for our children now that are facing the sacrifices that are going on in Israel and Palestine, I believe that in a bigger world, we are better than this, using animalistic ways to get over responsible things, things that you can talk things out. I believe that in a world where we can grow, we have to use our brains, our mouths, to be able to get our points across and be able to connect with more than one people, to be able to put adversities aside and be able to not only be able to connect with your people, but be able to put aside differences and be able to put aside violence and war, which is destroying not only our past, but only our future. Thank you so much. Miss Grand, Indonesia. I came from a broken family and grew up with my single mother and incredible grandmother who raised me with their strong love. The recent war happening between Israel and Palestine is heartbreaking and made me think 
of about children who might become homeless and grew up like me. War will destroy everything, including their family, dreams, and hope. Let us forgive, listen, and start dialogue so that no more children grow up broken. I call all international community to take an immediate and urgent action to prevent no more massacre. Doan Ketla Matsutka. Stop the war and violence. Come on. This grand Myanmar. in every conflict happening today. It is important that we raise our voices for peace. War and violence are never the answer to any conflict. They will only result in the sufferings of innocent civilians. I condemn all the acts of terror in the world and the specific targeting of children, women, and elderly. I urge the United Nations to take actions, no empty promises in war to help the country in war. Peace does not care a distant dream. Peace is a choice we can make today. Thank you. Miss Grand Netherlands. about war on the news. But for 110 million people, it's reality, and they are forced to run away from their homes. People in Israel and Palestine are currently running for their lives. Can you imagine looking for a safe space for your loved ones? However, everyone refuses and leaves you for the death. It's time to say enough is enough. How? No one is born hating another person. People learn to hate. But what we can do, and what we can do, is start teaching them the love. Start teaching our children the love so that they will only know war from history books. This grand Peru. in this world just for an instant and what we do in our time here must matter and be a service to humanity. I come as one but I stand for thousands of people who are affected by the war between Palestine and Israel. We may not have the power to stop war but we can spread peace through our daily actions. As a spokesperson I am here to raise my voice for the communities in both sides, hoping that their governments can find common ground on peaceful conversations. War only destroys homes and takes innocent lives. Violence is never the solution to a war that is in need of more compassion, love, and empathy. We are here, away from conflict, but it hurts because when it's an attack to people, it's a war to humanity. So let's all put our hand on our heart as a symbol of peace and solidarity with them because remember that we are one world, one life. Thank you. Miss Grand Thailand. of the killing, happiness, pride, or made money. You make it dark, but for me, war 
is the wood to humankind. I hope if the leader of Hamas and the leader of Israel can hear my voice, please learn from the past, learn from the pain. People born to have a good life, and I hope, I hope I hope that there would be no more violence and war in this world. Thank you. Miss Grand United States of America. Peace is not just the abstinence of war. It is the abstinence of discrimination, violence, and poverty. History is repeating itself. Israel and Palestine have a long history of division, but we can't forget that at the heart of this war are people just like you and I. The media, politics are everywhere, but we have to remember the mothers, the fathers, the children that dream of a life filled without fear and desires of simple joy, love, and happiness. We must not ignore the tears that have been shed with both sides, broken dreams, and innocent lives that have been lost. We must come together and continue to be the one and only to form a society where freedom is our white flag and everyone can have a peaceful heart and a peaceful home. Come on. Miss Grand Vietnam. my childhood and dream. Nothing can make me happy anymore. That is the joy of child in Gerrachit right now. The people, the children who was born in the world, grew up in the world, and lived the life because of the world, like Israel and Hamas. Have they even known how beautiful it is? As an architect, I feel heartbroken when I see the house and family destroyed by war. A thousand people die. Children cannot go to school. A million people fall into the heartless. They don't know where they go when they dare no home anymore. Today, I'm standing here. I want my voice to hurt. We so calm, let's quick conversations, but not quick guns. Let our children know how beautiful it is. And please, give best be to human beings. Chấm dứt chiến tranh, trả lại hòa bình cho nhân loại. Xin cảm ơn. Thank you to all of the speeches from our top 10. All wearing fabulously beautiful owl dyes designed by Vietnamese designer Trần Trắng Khen. Thank you so much.